एक फिफ्टी प्रोसेस बारी सेवेंटी प्रोसेस है यू वांट टू बी स्मार्टर दैन मी है यू फॉर्गेट नाम योर फादर यस एडे आई गिव यू सेवेंटी डिड यू ब्रिंग अ बैलेंस ऑफ ऑफ ट्वेंटी पी डिड यू है ओह यू थिंक आई फॉर्गेट नहीं लुक माय ब्रेन इज मोर देन कंप्यूटर इट इज Did you see the grass cutter I brought him? Did you? I did. Good. Then why have you written meat here? Eh? Is it not waste of scarce resources? Must I always repeat this to you? You know very well that my brother doesn't like grass cutter. Your brother doesn't like what? Your brother. Force him to like it. Force him to like it. Sometimes I don't understand if your brother is normal or abnormal. Sule. Why don't you like eating grass cutter? Has it got anything to do with your religion? Because your sister loves eating grass cutter even more than me, who buys it with my own money. I just don't like it. It has nothing to do with my religion. Is it the teeth or the hairy nature of grass cutter that scares you? None of the above. The miser. I've been wondering why you've not joined your friends for the extra classes. Is anything the matter? I wish I could, but... Um, um, what is the problem? Can I be of any help? My father has refused to pay for my extra classes fee. No, 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 wait. You and I know your father is what to do. But you just want to use that in this case? No, oh, sir, I cannot lie to you. You're a very brilliant student, and I'll be very sad if you don't make it. Do you think it would be necessary for me to talk to your father for you? I don't think that would be necessary. Okay, if you say so. But apart from your father, don't you have any other family member you can rely on? I'll talk to my mother and see what comes out of it. Okay then. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, sir. But then don't hesitate to contact me anytime you are in trouble. Okay, okay. sir. I'll be glad to help you. Okay, thank you very much. You're always welcome. Thank you, sir. Bye bye. bye. Aisha. Aisha. Yeah. Where are you? I'm in the bathroom. Are you hungry? No, no, no. I'm not hungry. Just wanted to know where you are. Mm. 
Hmm. This is what I call real bushmeat. Cut. In fact, after she serves meals this evening, I will count each meat in this pot. It was that brother of hers. I don't trust him. No. I don't trust him. To buy kinky. Going to buy kinky. Why didn't you wait for your sister to finish preparing the fufu so that we can all eat together with the soup? So I bought fried fish to eat with the kinky. Oh, I hope it's not because of what I said to you this morning. Huh? That's why you've gone to buy kinky and fish so that you you will avoid the grass cutter soup, isn't it? Oh no, sir. I, I just don't like grass cutter. Anyway. Once it's got nothing to do with me, I am okay. But I don't want to hear you say that I am deliberately starving you in this house. No, sir, you're not going to hear anything like that. He has a special reason why he doesn't like eating grass cutter. He looks like a grass cutter himself. Perhaps he may feel like he's eating himself. Della, Della, I hope that is not trying to play a fast one. What exactly do you mean? That is how called after closing seems to like you too much. And you too. You seem to give me too much attention. Why don't you ask me again? Oh no. That's not the point. You see, I I've realized that anytime he talks to you, his eyes keep sparkling like a lot of a cat at night. How were you able to see the spark in his eyes? Ah, but at least from a distance I could see it. He's a new service person posted to the school. He's only worried about the fact that I'm not part of the extra classes. Uh huh. The more reason I'm scared. See, those service personnel are very, very dangerous. The last one left here almost impregnated all the school girls in this town. Hey, me, I'm not just any girl, though. I'm Della. Um, how about tonight? 
I'm not 100% sure. Oh, Della. Oh. So, I know you're a smart girl. Eh? Please come, you're respecting me. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. I know you're accusing me like that. The Miser. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hi. It's almost 5 p.m. I thought you were supposed to close at 2 p.m. No, it's 3 p.m. 3 p.m. And what were you doing during this two hour period? I was copying notes from my friends since you have refused paying my extra classes fee. Shut up! Young woman! So, you want to prompt me to part with my hard-earned cash? Huh? Hmm? Is that it? When you're supposed to close early enough to come and help your mother do the cooking, you go about loitering. What is the problem this time? Your daughter is the problem. Eh? Tell her to come home early to help you do the cooking. Ejetu, if you don't teach her how to cook, she wouldn't be able to maintain her husband. And in the future, if she is sacked from her matrimonial home, there will be no place for you, you, in this house. You might probably have to find a place for her. Don't you think you are being too harsh on this girl? On this girl? Come on, get inside and get your uniform off. We have food to pound. I should. I should too. You keep shielding this girl all the time. And for you, she's still young. Don't rush her. Still young. You are telling me still young. Go out there and see. Girls of 12 years, 13 years, getting pregnant and getting married. Are they your daughters? The last time you traveled, this girl prepared light soup. And when I complained that the light soup was not delicious, you know what she did? She brought sugar and put it in the soup. Luckily, it was not dark out there. So I went out to find something to eat. Is that the girl we are talking about here? Didn't you say it wasn't delicious? You should have just asked her to bring you salt. Am I the one who is supposed to teach her that one? Not me. Your trouble is giving me a headache. I have to go and continue pounding that fufu before you start complaining that it is not as smooth as a mirror. Oh, let me fast though. Hurry up. I have enzyme secreting in my stomach. I don't want to get all sound. Can I eat? You know I don't like guys cut out. 
and I'm sure your father intentionally buys it because he knows I don't like it. Don't say that. At least you can tell Ma to buy you another meat in the market if you don't like Rascata. You talk as if you don't know your father. See. I have a proposal for you. This is why I like and love my wife Aisha too. Huh. When it comes to food, especially their native food, there is no challenge. Hey, today your food very delicious, you know, and as a compliment, I am going to buy a present for you. That is what you have always said. When food is ready, praises. Food over, war. <clears throat> This time, one minute. Thanks in advance. Oh, nice present for you. I should. Yeah. Ah. I should. My wife, I should. Mm. Yeah, food is beautiful. Wow. Oh, yeah. What about? I hope there's something in it for me. Hmm? It's more of help for me. Okay. What can I do for you? You know, our exams are approaching. And I need to study and finish hard. Mm -hmm. And you, you know, um, old boy will neither pay my part-time classes nor let me go out and study. Okay. So what do you intend to do about that? I I want to go out and study tonight. Ah, but why tonight? Are you trying to hide something? No, 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 no. It's because of my father. Look, you better come clean and tell me what's going on. Do you understand? You think I don't know you'll be hanging out with the guy in the shop? Be watching me. Sure. You promise to keep it a secret? Oh, of course, I have to. I mean, you know, I'm not particularly close to your father, and the man doesn't like me anyway. What about my mother? Don't worry, she won't hear about it. Okay. I'm going out with my boy. He, he has promised to help me with a steady fee. Oh, okay. That's that's nice, but. You're sure your father won't hit the roof when he hears about it? What can I do? I hope you're not trying to suggest that I should lie for you. No, 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 no. See, I, I have a spec into the hall. Mm? So when I go out, I want you to come and lock the door. And then later remove the key. So that when I come, I can open it and come inside. Okay. I'll do it for you. Sule, Sule! Let me your fish. Mm? Thank you.